Okay, so um, I deal with these micro squirt connectors quite a bit and just thought it'd be helpful to show other people how to mess with them. Um, they're an amp seal connector. They're really actually cool and simple to use. It's just sometimes uh, without a tutorial, it's hard. So the first thing you do is on the sides, when this is all the way clipped in, um, these clips on the side, they need to be pulled out slightly. And what you'll notice is these clips are actually holding this black tongue on a, this inner clip. So it's kind of a balance of pulling this out and getting the screwdriver in and pulling back on the uh, that metal tongue just a little bit. It's really hard to show on a camera, but you can get the idea like this pulls back, but you also at the same time have to pull back that tongue. Once that's off, um, yeah, once that's off, you can, like I said, pop these off a little bit. It's like a two stage, like the first stage of this outer clip and then there's another stage on the inside right in here with these tongues. But that guy just pops out and you can set that aside. And then once you get into it, like I usually depin these because there's so many wires that I don't use like these uh, CAN buses and the MAF and stuff. Um, get the, uh, the wire you want um, kind of figured out. You can wiggle it around. And down inside there's a clip on either side of the pin and you can use just a baby flat blade it's a little bit tricky. Um, it sometimes is a little harder than um, than it should be, but they'll just pop out. You have to wiggle both sides of it because there's a there's basically two pins or two like tongues that are plastic that grab the pin on each side, and you just have to spread both of them enough with the screwdriver kind of flat to pull it out. So just pop that guy out wiggle it like this and there you go so and then to put them back in just stick the red piece back in click it all the way down and you're good but there you go